Kyle, as we go through the highlights from this game, you know what? They didn't start great in the first period, but Toledo had a stretch in the first that they played very well. They got the goal. They had the lead. A lot of things going right, and then that second period happened. Yeah, you know what? You said it right. They, they won the last 10 minutes of that first period. They had momentum. They got the big goal. The teddy bears were flying, and you thought it was going to be a great second period like it has been. But uh, Cincinnati had a different approach to the second period, and, and they won the game with, with that 20 minutes. And you know what? You were talking with Dan Watson there, and you mentioned uh, he mentioned some of the chances that Toledo had with odd man rushes, especially earlier in the game. I, I, they, it just felt like we were getting opportunities there, and then finally we did get the goal from Tyler Spezia. Yeah, I, I, that shift right there, Matt, that they scored on, that, that was their best shift all game. And they just hounded Cincinnati. They hemmed them in the offensive zone. They had their defensive switches, and they got rewarded with a big-time goal. And then the second period, again, nice transitional game that Toledo has, that speed, a two-on-one, and, and you thought they were going to be sitting pretty here through the second period. It didn't work out for Toledo because then a little bit later on, Jesse Schultz, dangerous goal scorer, finds the back of the net there on the breakaway. Cincinnati had tied the game at one. Yeah, Larson, that's a tough one for him, uh, you know, a breakaway like that with a goal scorer, 14 goals a season. It's, uh, he can't have that happen. It was a break, and they, t they capitalized on it. And back-to-back -back power play goals, and after two periods of play, Toledo trailing it 3-1 to one in the third period. Schultz again on a breakaway, and a nice stop there by Larson. Yeah, that's a big save by Larson there. Stay with it, another breakaway, and he knew who was coming down on him because he had that first goal for Cincinnati. Same scenario, and he made a big save. And there you go, Justin Vive made it four to one. Josh Winquist had some chances, but Lukanen gets the win. As we take a look at our college advantage stats, 36-27 were the final shots. So Toledo's string of seven consecutive games, Kyle, with 30 or more shots ends here today. And that second to last line, the special teams, you talk about it, always so key, Toledo unable to win it tonight. 